to make them secure, what we're basically go going to do is to reuse the technologies or the same technologies we use for the IT world, but obviously with some adaptation. So for example, we're going to need specific signatures that will be able to recognize the kind of malware that we would find more in an OT environment than in an IT environment. Uh, the other thing as well that we're going to be uh, putting in, in place is using access control mechanisms so that we know exactly, for example, which um, of the uh, HMI machines, the ones that control the systems, are allowed to talk to which PLC robots. So we can actually put in place string, stringent access control policies that restrict who can access what resource and thereby we're making it secure without introducing any latency or introducing any additional risk in the existing OT world.